This is the Pocket Monster Manual. I'm Willie Shambler, here with Mike. Animage. What happens when two frogs collide? This is what happens when frogs collide! <laughs> <laughs> well, they get tongue-tied. Bram. Tongue, tongue-tied. Cat. Frog. Muggle. Froggy. Specs. A beverage of sorts. Stop! Stop it! We're talking about Toxic Croak. He's cool. Oh, I love Toxic Croak. I also like this one a lot. I think it's a good line. I think Krog, like Krogunk and Toxic Croak both work very well together and also by themselves. I I don't think we needed Toxic Croak, but it's fine. It looks cool. Fine. And I think it, what? it expands nicely on what Krogunk had as well. But like, I think Krogunk on its own, like could have just been a standalone Pokemon, you know? No, I think he looks like a guy who evolves. I mean, yeah, if, if he's going to be actually useful in the game, then... He's got dirty middle toes now as well. Yeah, his toes are toxic now. He's also got a dirty Sanchez mustache now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. He's got a John Waters mustache. I love the mustache, yeah. Interestingly, he's grown an extra finger, and the poison finger has, like, moved up and become, like, a stinger barb. I love the stinger barbs on his hands. That's an incredibly, like, coke nail level of Pokemon finger. In the Pokedex, it says that uh, the, the finger is poisonous. If you scratch it, you'll die. You'll die? You'll die. But your back will feel amazing. Yeah. 30 seconds of back ecstasy. I controlled F die. There's no there's no reference to death here. You're uh, <clears throat> it's knuckle claws secrete a toxin so vile that even a scratch could prove fatal. Okay. Well fatal's not the same as dying. When he when he gets to low HP in Mystery Dungeon, he says, feels like I'm about to croak. I get uh... it. No, wise guy, eh? His chest bandages have moved down to his groin now as well. Because he's been kicked in the balls one too many times. <laughs> <laughs> mm. It's a tough guy thing. Yeah, yeah. I don't have a lot of notes on this guy. Poison fighting is a cool type combo. At the time, I think it was unique. I just love the idea of like a guy who punches you, but then also has like a stinger on his hands and poisons you. He's a dirty fighter. Yeah, that was one of the new unarmed weapons in uh, Shadow of the Erd Tree. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> Tarnished. Fighting, fighting a delinquent and he, he dips his, like, knife in sewage water. They used to call that the Stinger. They don't let you use that no more. <laughs> uh, apparently, this Pokemon and Seismitoad are a related species. Because they're frogs. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm not making the Pokemon Tree of Life. Oh, the claws on its hands may be inspired by the hairy frog, which defends itself by breaking its own toes and projecting sharpened bones from its skin. What? What? Do you not look at the hairy frog? It's a fucked up creature. It looks... That's a Kekai Genkai if I ever heard one. Mm. Everybody's looking at the hairy frog now. <laughs> I'm looking at the hairy frog. Also known as the horror frog or wolverine frog. This is by far the least nice frog I've ever seen. Yeah, he doesn't look nice. This is the most fucked up bastard I've ever seen. <laughs> I, I, listen, listen, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm like lukewarm to tolerant when it comes to hair on like arachnids. It's like, okay, I guess you gotta have it, but no, nah, I'm, not, I'm not fucking down with reptile hair. He's an amphibian. Can Captain Caveman ass frog over here? Holy fuck. Yeah, I like nothing about that. That's, that's, I don't like it. Well, they should have made this guy hairy. Obviously, yeah. Yeah, give him armpit hair. <laughs> <laughs> that, would have, that would have increased the sex appeal a bit, I think. To dangerous levels. Oh, also, you find this guy in the fucking, like, Great Marsh, and that place is a pain in the ass. What the, uh, is that the safari zone of the game? Yeah, but it's, like, swampy, and you're constantly getting, like, stuck in the mud, and you have to keep, like, mashing your D-pad to get out of it. Is this a good Pokemon to actually use in the game? Yeah. I've used it before. He's pretty solid. He's not, like, incredible. He's very frail. Poison Touch is a pretty good ability. Yes, it is. Yeah. 97 pounds. Damn. That's a lot that's of frog. Big... Yeah, that's a big fucking frog. <laughs> well, it's four it's foot tall. It's one of those Pokemon I've wanted to use but never have. I used him in, like, a recent-ish Platinum playthrough, and he's pretty good. He wasn't, like, remarkable. Good Pokemon. Good Pokemon. Pew!
Oh, all right. Yeah, no, I got you. I got, I, I got you, pimp. Oh, that's way nicer. <laughs> Team of Toxicroak.